Loveholic merch coming soon. Dr. Laughlin merch coming soon. R.I.P. to the old internet, internet city merch. To that. Welcome to hell. Almost one year ago, I featured a series of videos by a young Dutch woman named Sabia L. Right, right, Sabia right, right. claimed that her apartment in the Netherlands was haunted by something that lurked in the shadows. Something dark and sinister. Hey, yo! We gonna start like this? We gonna start like this? Already? We're 10 seconds in. We're 10 seconds in, bro! Okay, see. Oh my god. That could be 3D. Poes gaat er ook al vandoor. Oh no! Nah, we ain't seen this one before. What happened? What happened? Oh! That man jumped. Intensified, becoming so terrifying that Sabia began to live in abject fear of whatever evil presence might be haunting her home. Nine months ago, Sabia L suddenly just stopped posting to YouTube entirely, leaving her concerned fans and followers wondering just what she happened. Got... But then, just three months okay, ago, okay, Sabia okay. made a surprise return to her YouTube channel. She posted only one short video. The post was a positive one, letting her followers know that she had finally saved up enough money to okay. move out of her terrifying haunted apartment. Okay. The 30 second video shows Sabia giving one final walkthrough of the empty apartment. I even that. Her optimistic video title proclaimed, Last Video, Haunted Apartment in the Netherlands. No more poltergeist activity for me. Right. As you might guess, oh, no. Sabia L's nightmarish story did not end there. Sabia says that she experienced months of peace and relaxation in her new home. Okay. That goes in. I found you, bitch. <laughs> I found you, motherfucker. <laughs> then strange and disturbing things begin to happen all over. Well, I thought about that. <laughs> the fucking Wayne's brothers. <laughs> the Wayne's brothers. Oh, this shit. <laughs> Again, the odd events quickly became more and more unsettling. One night, the lights in her hallway begin to flicker, so she pulls out her phone and begins to record. She encounters something absolutely horrifying. That joint nice. That's a nice one. Oh, somebody what in there with her? The new house. What the hallway? That's the hallway? Or is that the hallway? It must That's be. The kitchen. No, the door, the door, where the door okay. is. Oh, 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 boy, if I see a nigga, it's like, it's gonna be somebody in there. It's gonna be a nigga just standing there. It's gonna be a. It's gonna be I a can't nigga. do this. It's I can't. Be, I can't. It's, it's gonna, gonna be a nigga just standing. It's gonna there. be a nigga standing. Oh my it's gonna god. Be a nigga standing in there, bitch. It's a new it's ghost. Gonna be standing there. He's just gonna be standing there. <laughs> what is that? Someone. You wanna know what's weird? You wanna know what's weird? I've noticed this. What? This little dot. Right. I've noticed it in all her videos. Yeah. I don't know what that is. An orb. Could it be like? Could it be like? An orb. Uh, uh, a flash. Could it be like the flash from camera? It could be a flash, but because I've seen this joint in every one of her videos. Mm. Don't go back. Oh, she got to sleep back there. Oh, she got. She got to sleep back there. Right. Oh, is that the front? Oh, you opening the door, you crazy! Oh, the stairs that way. How big is that apartment? That's a big apartment. What are you doing? I don't think nothing happened yet. What? What? The what? Fuck is that? Dude? It's what? In the door. Look at, look at, right there. You see that? What do we use the mouse? Use the mouse. Use the mouse so they can see what you're talking about. 
right here. It's gonna be right here. I hope that's just there. You see that? No, that's right. the stash. That's the black on the stash. But that whole disappeared. What? That's the black on the stash. That's the black. Okay, I'll buy the. That's the black on the stash. Ah, ah, ah. Okay, it's not that big. No, don't look up the stairs. Don't look up. Hey, where's it gonna be? Why they got the Joker theme music? The Batman. Oh, that's where. That's where the the, the blood. I can't. Is. I can't take this. I can't. I can't take this. I can't. That was uneventful. That was uneventful as hell. Uneventful as fuck. Still uneventful. She scared though. Oh, cut up. Oh! Don't go in there. Wait, 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 wait. I didn't see nothing. Y'all saw something? No, I can't do this. I can't fucking do this. I can't fucking do that. Put it on. I can't. My anxiety is killing me. I'm so sick. <laughs> it smell like bitch in here. Listen to me. It smell like bitch in here. I don't give a fuck. Put it on. It smell like bitch in here. It smell like bitch. We all solid. Damn. It smell like straight bitch. Mm. Pussy. That's definitely pussy. Put your headphones on. Oh, 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 this shit hard. But but the fuck. After what we've experienced, this shit hard. So I want to see what she saw. This shit hard. What did she see? I think she felt the presence. Oh, oh why the fuck is it always? Oh, that's what she saw. What? Ooh. What she saw? Look at the other screen. Oh shit! <laughs> it's a nigga. That's a nigga. That's a nigga. We can't see We it. can't see it, but y'all can. Y'all should. Why can't we? Because our screen, that's crazy. That's, that's a, a nigga. nigga. <laughs> oh! 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 That's a nigga. That's a nigga. That's a nigga. Get out of the way. <laughs> I can't do that. I can't do that. <laughs> That's a nigga! That's a nigga! That's a nigga! That's a nigga! He was standing there! You got it? You good? I'm good. <laughs> Y'all good? I ain't good. Cut the light off. No. Cut the light off. No. You decided this is how we doing this. Oh, no. Put the headphones on. Come on. That's... <laughs> oh. Oh, oh, hell no. It's that nigga ran scary. up and down the stairs. Baby, why would you go in the darkness? Oh, that nigga cut the light on. I that nigga say this is my house. Yeah, no, don't Big bell volume on. Did you see it? Yeah, we saw it. Sabia no. turns away from the hallway as a light fixture suddenly moves on its own. When she turns back, the hall light has gone out again, and something dark and menacing it's seems to be nigga. waiting there for her. Whatever it is then seems to charge up the stairs, but understandably, Sabia does not follow. <laughs> Nah, 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 nigga. Nigga, I'm telling you. I'm telling you. I'm telling you, nigga. Like, nigga, I'd, I'd, I'd be so terrified I'd have to kill it. I'd literally have to fucking murder it. They said, just leave. She left. She, she just got this apartment, folks. This is a new apartment. She, just saved she moved out of the old one. <laughs> that, that motherfucker said, baby, it's fair. <laughs> go wherever you go. Come on, man, tighten up. We, she we, left. Come on, man, tighten up. He said, I found you. I'm pretty sure you kill a ghost. They already dead. They could die again. I was gonna say, I don't know about that. <laughs> Nigga, death, death is, death is anybody. Anything can die. You hear me? Water. Uh, 
Oh, if it exists, it can be killed. Sabia L believes that the dark malevolent being that haunted her old apartment has now followed her to her new home. But what do you think? Let me know down in the comments. You can watch this video as well as all of Sabia L's past terrifying encounters over on her channel, Sabia L. Did somebody give subs and y'all just subscribing yeah, like subscribing. this? They just subscribing like this? Hey! Okay. A window to the soul. So this is a story that starts weird and just gets weirder. But first, a little bit of history. Way back in 1679, Irish Catholic priest Oliver <laughs> Plunkett was arrested for supporting the Catholic faith, which at the time was considered a serious criminal offense by the English monarchy. He was held in Newgate Prison in London before being executed. And so here's where things get really weird. Over 240 years later, in 1921, Oliver Plunkett's head Yes, just his head was brought to St. Peter's Church in Drawheda, Ireland, where it was put on display in a garish, ornately decorated what? glass box. The St. Peter's Church also placed on display the prison door of Oliver Plunkett's jail cell. Who puts a head on display? How did they keep it? Well, that's why. Like, yeah, like, how did they preserve that motherfucker? Yeah, is that a tear? Yes. Yes, it is. I'm scared, <laughs> scared. I'm serious. <laughs> oh, you about to go through some shit tonight. I'm going that ghost gonna beat your ass. <laughs> that motherfucker. <laughs> From the gate prison. That motherfucker, yo, you gonna be asleep. You know, look, your couple gonna be raising up. <laughs> and it goes like, woo, 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 woo. <laughs> That nigga might go shut up. So. <laughs> oh, Where Plunkett was held for eight months before his execution. YouTube user Vicky Bramshaw was on vacation when she visited St. Peter's Church in Drogheda, Ireland. She is recording the exhibit of Oliver Plunkett's jail cell door when she right. catches something absolutely unnerving. Hey, really in the box. This is the door of the cell in Newgate Prison where St. Oliver Plunkett was in prison for eight months. He's a very interesting figure. Oh! Ecumenical Christian priests. There is a small opening in the ancient jail cell door, and Please some pale, ghostly face just seems to peek out of it Please at be them. A part of the Vicky says she has no idea what this face could be. She says she has no knowledge of visual effects to fake something like this, and she didn't even notice the face until she reviewed her footage later. I'm telling you, nigga, so is this the ghost of I Oliver Plunkett still peering from his old jail cell door? <laughs> or is it just a very very odd trick of the law. That's line. gotta be a part of the exhibit. You decide. Please. Before we move on to the next right. video, if you see anything that you think should be included in the top five, contact us at nukestop5 at gmail.com. The Haunting Tales of Chernobyl. I ain't got no ghosts. On April 26, 1986, no. reactor number four in the Chernobyl nuclear power plant exploded, resulting in the worst nuclear catastrophe in history. A total of 117,000 people were evacuated, but many suffered horrific tragic deaths as lethal levels of radiation swept over the countryside. To this day, the land around the reactor is still highly radioactive. Oh, it has no. been deserted for over 35 years. Italian paranormal investigators Paolo, Debbie, Jack, and Simone from the YouTube channel. Y'all so infatuated okay. with this okay. ghost stuff. Y'all going to okay. a radioactive okay. site. Okay, so like this is this is my to thing. do it. This is my thing. <laughs> this is this is my Double thing, trouble. right? This is my thing. What you is know, your thing, man? You know, niggas die everywhere, right? Niggas die every day, B. Niggas die every day, B. But niggas die, died in Chernobyl. Yeah. Niggas, niggas melted. I melted. Niggas was eviscerated. You know what I'm saying, nigga? You know, like that sound. When it sucks in all the air before it, them niggas heard like, that. The insides were literally the THX theme song. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. and, I'm like, and I'm yeah. like, I'm, you know, I'm like, I'm in this bitch as a cognitive human being. As a cognitive Negro. Like, like just a Negro Negroing. Right. Right. And I'm like, why the fuck? For one, possible death still there because, you know, fucking, it's still radioactive. Right. And secondly. Mm -hmm. 
You not you not scared of the radioactivity or or the possibility people die died there. And like like most places might not be haunted. Right. But somewhere like appreciate somewhere uh, like Chernobyl nigga tonight. Chernobyl, Japan. Like places Please like that. Help you, my brother. Those places like that, Chernobyl and Japan right. were like massive death yes. And yes. Mexico. And well Mexico ain't never got hit with a bomb bomb, but definitely Mexico. Cartel deaths, my boy. A lot of them. Yeah, but I don't know. Well, spirits. I don't know how spirit yeah. spirit. I don't know how they, how you know, spirit. do how they thing. Spirit. But my thing is, nigga, they died. That was an explosion. I'm I'm sure nigga ghosts gonna be upset. <laughs> nigga, dogs don't even like. There's dogs in Chernobyl, but they they literally it's parts of Chernobyl. That's not radioactive. Because right. I was watching a documentary, The right. Dogs of Chernobyl. Right. Nigga, the dogs literally won't go in certain buildings. Nigga, is that not odd? So Does that not seem suspicious? Does that hey, not that suspicious? Like, and you niggas, I, it's so hard not saying it. <laughs> it's so hard. But... They not they just out here doing the stupidest shit. Because what happen? Like, what happens if you light a match in Chernobyl? Oh. Like you ever wonder? <laughs> Number two, like <laughs> Boom. <laughs> the Pit Paranormal Boom. Investigation have the unique opportunity to explore and investigate the abandoned ghost town surrounding the Chernobyl power plant. Experienced tour guide Alex safely escorts the group through the dangerous area. The pit team begins their journey in Pripyat, the city closest to the Chernobyl power plant. The nervous investigators soon realize that they have to conduct their investigation in an entirely different way than normal, as everything around them is highly contaminated with radioactive fallout. E dobbiamo completamente cancellare tutte le abitudini che abbiamo. Ed è una cosa difficilissima. È difficilissimo, ma anche solo appoggiare uno zaino momentaneamente per terra. They most likely have cancer. Yeah, like not even in a joke, because a lot of the people who left Chernobyl, even years later, all had fucking severe health issues as well as cancer. And them motherfuckers just out there motherfucking. Yeah. They can't even leave nothing on the ground. Si può. Non si può appoggiare, non lo so, non un ginocchio per scarpa, terra per legarti no la scarpa. Mask, non si no può. Okay, no. Raga, è veramente una you know cosa. Guardate, solo così. Fare. Cioè, questo è un contatore Geiger. And you're happy like about it. Nigga, you're you happy got, about nigga, it. Nigga, the craziest part. This is the craziest part. If you can't touch your knee to the ground to tie your shoe, nigga, your shoes are touching the ground. Yeah. You got to get rid of them bitches. Yeah, it sounds it. like niggas don't. Man, I don't know. Pioni, solo per dirvela brevemente, siamo a 1.40, 1.50, e contate che la soglia massima, massima, è 0.30. Now, most of the abandoned buildings in Pripyat are extremely dangerous to enter, so it's illegal to go inside most structures. For this reason, investigator Paolo has brought along a small remote-controlled car with an attached GoPro. You're not supposed to be able to pick up the car, Pablo. You sick fuck. And I don't mean sick as in your brain, because you are. I mean you're actually fucking sick now. He carefully drives it into one of the abandoned structures <laughs> as he records. After a bit of exploring with the RC car, he stops it inside and leaves the camera recording in an attempt to capture anything out of the ordinary. When they review their footage, the team is shocked. Oh, that's not the darkness! Now, as I mentioned before, Powell and his team are all outside and no one is allowed into this building. So what? Huh? It could have been a fucking what? I don't even know what I said there. I just, I just a bird, a plane, a dog. A plane? A plane? A plane? A strange shadow moves from right to left, seemingly followed by two other strange shadow anomalies. Oh, two more? Soon the That's investigators are forced to leave the area, as they can only be exposed to the high radiation level for a limited time. <laughs> Another night, and the pit <laughs> paranormal team has the unique opportunity to explore the abandoned old Chernobyl hospital. 
Obviously, the building was the site of intense tragedy and suffering, as many passed away here during the Chernobyl meltdown. It is said that their spirits still haunt the hospital. The pit team brings all of their equipment, hoping to properly investigate the hospital and maybe even make contact with any spirits that might inhabit the building. Like, say for example, one of them ghosts just get mad as fuck, right? Like, they already I, mad. I mean, like madder than normal. Mm, they boiled. Right? Like they see, like they see these niggas coming in, bitches living life, right? And they're like, motherfucker, you alive? And mind you, they can't touch anything, right? Just pushing and that ghost grab a <laughs> fucking bed. Yay! <laughs> <laughs> <Just, laughs> It just hit them niggas on a bed. What they gonna do? What you gonna do? You got it now! <laughs> what they got you got it now! It is truly bizarre. A strange, unexplained sound startles the pit paranormal team. Paolo grabs his thermal camera and starts to record. What happens next is downright chilling. Not the, not the thermal. That looks like a fucking fire. <laughs> <laughs> A creepy figure seems to appear but can only be seen through the thermal camera. Inexplicably, the figure seems to emit more and more heat. Paolo and cameraman Simone approach the apparition and they discover something terrifying. One minute! That that is is, a that's, that's a phone. phone! In something. It might be like a cage. <laughs> That's footsteps. What if they're recording their own footprints? I can see it. Stai scherzando la porta. È chiusa, tu sei chiusa. Non chiusa, non chiusa. Mi sembra che abbia anche ripresa. Perché mi sta cucinando per venire a prenderti in faccia. E mi sembra che l'ho anche ripresa che sta chiudendo io lontano. Non chiusa io, non chiusa io. Paolo and Simone are shocked as the thermal camera reveals footprints on the floor in the room right next to where the figure appeared. The door slams shut and locks, separating Debbie and cameraman Jack. And now, they too encounter- It would have been hilarious if she was by herself. If she was by herself, nigga, I would have died. Nigga, if they closed, if a door closed, nigga, I would- <laughs> it was I'm hilarious. Just, I'm just screaming. Something <laughs> terrifying out in the hospital hall. C'è qualcuno che ci sta prendendo in giro? Non ci vuole far paura? C'è qualcuno? Chi c'è? Cos'era? Che 
Arriva da quella porta, c'è una porta socchiusa, Debbie. Arriva da quella porta lì. Arriva da quella porta lì. Arriva da quella porta lì, è socchiusa. Did you hear it? The two nervous investigators capture a deep breath like voice on camera. Cos'era? Porta lì. Arriva da quella porta lì, è socchiusa. Eventually, the team is reunited and they leave Chernobyl believing that they did in fact make contact with some of the ghosts of Chernobyl's past. I highly recommend that you check out Pit Paranormal's eight-part Chernobyl series. All eight videos have subtitles in multiple languages, including English. Excessively haunted. Now, if you're a regular Nuke's Top 5 viewer, you know oh, that no! I've featured the popular paranormal YouTube channel Really Haunted many times. Homeowners Lee and his wife Stacy have experienced increasingly violent paranormal activity in their home in England for years now. And it oh, that's just them! seems to keep... That's them! No! Lee's wife Stacy says that since the bed incident, she is so scared of the violent poltergeist in their house that she often just avoids sleeping in their home. Why are you still in the home? Mother, I want to make YouTube videos about the girls, so I'm staying home nigga, nigga, and not sleep. Nigga, nigga, this is real. Let me show you why this is real. And it's one only one fucking reason. That she often just avoids sleeping in their home. Nigga, she's grasping at the bed with her fingers. Yeah. That motherfucker is trying to stop. <laughs> <laughs> he wants some booty. <laughs> he wants some ass. Jeez. I'd stayed in the caravan a bit before that, but that was the, once was that the happened, I never went back in the house after that. Over the four months since I last featured Really Haunted, Lee says that the activity in his home has only become more intense and frightening. Bro, why are y'all still there? Why? <laughs> you don't need nothing else to move. Sleeping in the car. Oh, oh, they can start the. That is, that's gas. No, that's a gas. Oh. That's gas. Nigga. That's gas. Yes. Oh. Yes. company. He can make it. If he can make... have friends tonight. If he wanted. If he wanted. Bro, if he wanted company. All he gotta do is throw this rag over there. <laughs> Fuck Lit this rag. Fire! Join me, motherfucker! <laughs> nigga, nigga, nigga. You, you can't just keep the gas. You can't do that. Whole... <sighs> that nigga can probably light a match. Nigga, nigga, all that motherfucker gotta do, say, say, get the cognitive. It has the wherewithal to start a fire. Mm -hmm. Say one day it just hit it, right? It barely hit it. Gas start coming, and gas is coming for a while. They don't and even know it, and then it. that motherfucker. <laughs> Over. That's over. He started to start. Uh, what? Stop. <laughs> Set. <laughs> 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 
Lee says that he refuses to leave his home, regardless of- Nigga, you're a bitch. You're an idiot. You're a bitch. You're a bitch. You're not you tough for that. You're a bitch. You know why you're a bitch? Because you're stupid. You fucking, you do that. Yeah, fuck up my life. That motherfucker. <laughs> he's sleeping there alone, nigga, bro. Nigga, bro nigga. He's sleeping there alone, bro. Nigga, you know how fucked up a ghost got to be? Nigga, nigga, we black. Our ghost would fucking kill us. <laughs> Now we're dead. Our ghosts killed us because we're black in America. The police thought we broke in and slept in their bed like Goldilocks and Three Bears and ended us. It'd be fucking crazy. Who, who's going to know it was a fucking ghost? Nobody. Lee says that he refuses to leave his home regardless of the extreme poltergeist activity. Why? But facing oh, off against a malevolent no spirit is not easy. Bro, you can't sleep Late anywhere! Late one night, he hears noises outside his second story bedroom. You he gets up to investigate, anywhere. but it did not go well. In the meantime, we're gonna go for an astral phone. This nigga oh, my oh, oh, we can check. What? I didn't realize that motherfucker had a reflection. So we can check if somebody pulled that big motherfucker. Uh, I mean, woman out the bed. <laughs> <laughs> we, can, we can check. We can t oh, of course. The, the curtains was closed. Mm. 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 You can't. No. Mm. You can't. Mm. Very coincidental. Mm. Can Very coincidental. <laughs> I knew it! I knew it! What happened? I what knew happened? it! He got pushed! He got pushed! He got pushed! I knew he was gonna get pushed! He got pushed! Oh. <laughs> and you don't wanna leave? Oh. You don't wanna leave? Now you sit there going, oh. <laughs> Imagine that All you can do is smile. Imagine that bitch draw them. Mika, look. All he can do is smile. All he can do is smile. Oh, you can't see. There you go. All he can do is smile. Yeah, that's a good one. Yeah. That nigga said, get back in there. Round two, motherfucker. You said, get back in that room, nigga. You stuck. You stuck. Oh. Look at this. Oh. <laughs> I don't care about your cameras, your blocks. Your wife is gone. Get out. Shut out Some to her camera. Door. Shut out to her Something seems to violently push Lee, launching him backwards. And whatever pushed him now wants in the room. Nice. That's the attic. Oh, she ain't sleeping in the house. Show the outside camera. She refused to go in the house. How can it be doing both at once? So is Lee's house, quote, really haunted? No, As always, I, I leave that to camera. you to decide. And to see the full like story and videos of Lee's time. encounter with the dark presence that terrorizes his home, I highly recommend checking out the YouTube channel, Really Haunted. There's no way. Why would you? This has got to be a setup channel. Why would you yeah, stay that, there? And he's smiling. Yeah. And he's yeah. Smiling. That, Why that, would you stay there? Yeah, that got to be fake. That got to be fake. Unwelcome. Paranormal investigator Sandro Silva from the YouTube channel Casa Sobrenatural sets out to explore an abandoned home in Brazil. The house is said to be extremely haunted by multiple dark spirits. He's joined by his two friends, Macon and Klimerson, as they carefully walk through the rubble of the deserted structure. The air feels heavy as the team reflects on the ominous atmosphere. Suddenly, they get an unexpected fright. Essa energia é muito pesada, mano. Essa casa é sinistra, mano. Ficou um luz, cara. Os padrões de casa. Meu Deus do céu, Sandro. Você viu o barulho, mano? 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 
Yeah, stuff just gonna fall. Oh, yeah. Oh, the building is falling apart. Stop this. Stop this. Pesada. Vocês viram que caiu a teia ali, mano. Nossa, foi nítido, cara. Quebrou, mano. Vamos arpar o pé daí, mano. Mano, caiu a teia ali, velho. Pô, como é jogar teia em cima da nossa cabeça, é louco? Tem alguma coisa aqui, cara, que não quer nós aqui, mano. Não. The three friends suspect a roof tile has fallen nearby and discuss roof whether tiles. it's safe to continue their... Pieces of the building don't really count in this situation. Because yeah. no, 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 it's... That mother about to... <laughs> the whole roof about to fall apart. Yeah, that nigga sneezing that bitch. They yeah, all die, they bitch. gone. <laughs> they hit the wrong board. It's a freaking avalanche. Investigation. But before they can even reach a decision, things take a terrifying turn. What? Awesome, man. Nossa, velho. Oh, oh. Nossa, tá andando, mano. Tá andando, mano. Você tá escutando? Tô, cara. Tem alguma coisa aqui, cara. Ah, oh, aí, cara. Oh, that's a nigga. That's a... That's a nigga. That's a... That's a man. Right there. That's a man. Oh, right there. That's a man. Oh, that's just a homeless nigga. That's a homeless nigga. That nigga's homeless. I know how homeless nigga's homeless. That nigga's probably crack. That is a homeless crack. That's why he in that building. He's looking for crack. He's looking for crack. He's That's not. That's not even an apparition. That's a drug addict. That's a nigga on hard times. He look time. black. I ain't even gonna lie to you. He's in Brazil. He's obviously look black. They, he's on bail. That nigga ain't no kind of nothing. Meu Deus do céu, você não sabe o que eu vi ali, cara. Calma, cara. Eu vi que eu vi uma criança. Eu vi uma criança, cara. Calma, cara. Você não viram? Eu não vi, eu não vi. Meu Deus do céu, eu tinha uma criança aqui, cara. Nossa, eu tinha uma criança aqui, cara. Cara, primeira vez, cara. Mas o que uma criança vai estar aqui, cara? Você não viu uma criança aqui, cara? Now, if it was a kid, it's a different story. Small crackhead. That's what I'm about to say. I was about to say. Small crackhead. Small crackhead. A small crackhead? Yeah, crackhead with height problems. Crackhead and cara. Aí você grita que viu alguma coisa que é. Eu quero que eu vou correr. Mas eu não vi nada, cara. Nossa senhora, caiu uma telha ali, cara. Você tá doido, mano. Cara, tem, tem, tem visagem aqui pra caramba, mano. Você tá doido, velho. Sandro is shocked as he sees the pale apparition of a child right in front of him. He gathers his courage and checks out the area, but. There's no one there. Then another roof tile falls and the three friends just make a run for it. <laughs> so did the Casa Sobrenatural team capture the ghost of a child on camera? Mini crackhead, maybe? Let me know what you maybe. think. What do y'all think? That what do you like, have to say? What like, do you have to say for yourself? That was mad, that was mad. That was mad. That was mad. Hey man, click the next video. And while you there, subscribe, you doofus smirks.